Very, very good point. So, you know, early on in these slides, we talk about how there, it is a little bit more of a art than a science, um, especially when it comes to the finessing of the product. But um, even nowadays, we're seeing more robotic polishing uh, here at BPI and across the globe. Um, what, what are you seeing from the robotic polishing? Tell me a little bit about what your, your experience is so far. It is kind of it's taking some weight off the guy, you know, and the employee and applying it on the robot. It, yeah, it helps out. Okay, so you're, you're, you're talking specifically from like ergonomics. Ergonomics, yeah. Okay. Yeah, That's I awesome. mean, okay. it also helps a lot on the polishing aspect. Okay. Right? Okay. Yeah, no, you know, I'll, I'll speak honestly too. When I when I first heard about robotic polishing, I thought the same thing. It's got. I was it's, skeptical. It's got to be an art, right? Yeah. You know, this this whole thing's an art, but um, I think what we've seen uh, from the robot polishing is really taking that in in taking a large chunk of that that weight and that work off yeah. the, the the people in the department, getting it a certain percentage of the way there, where you're still coming back, maybe sometimes. Right. Uh, finessing it in, uh, but not all the time. Where it could be coming off complete still. Um, so far, they they're with the goal in mind that they're coming off 80, 90, 90 percent complete. Um, where some are still getting finessed, but I think uh, we're, we're, yeah. there's products being designed through right now too that are they're coming off 100 percent complete. Um, and I think it goes back to almost your your different types of grit right. and, and what what type of tools you can use too because they're. Dependent. I mean, you're either pulling it off, or, or there's too many nooks and crannies, or complicated, you know, parts that you have to go in and do a little bit more right. finessing on. But no, believe me, I was skeptical. Right? Yeah, because I'm old, old fashioned. Sure, sure. And in 40 years, old you've seen school. a lot, right? Yeah. <laughs>